Sometimes portals and vortexes open up over your house. Now while working on this still shot, I got an EMI effect on the sound. That's awesome. So it was touching another realm. Well, welcome everybody. This is C. Fernald, Night Watchman. Hey, I knew when I seen this picture from David, there was something I seen on TV that looked just like this. Job of the Hut. Now, this picture has a lot in it, so I'm going to show you real slow over a period of time and kind of point out some things. If you're on a cell phone, you might want to cast this to a TV. But what I see in here is phenomenal. I'm gonna take this through some filtering and stuff. And see what we get, okay? And comment. Tell me what you see in this uh, multi-dimensional picture. This is no other than a vortex opening up from one location in another world, second heavens, into this location. I don't believe that's a moon that David child machine I thought that I, I was thinking more like it was a crystal ball on this demon's lap but anyways nevertheless I'm jacking this thing up multi maximizing it as high as I can go uh, let me put some good music on and we'll start this thing so folks you can see what was happening um, the more I started filtering this the more it was like an EMI effect on my voice with the microphone now I don't know if that's gonna happen right here but as you watch this this is um, you know it's it's Revelation 9 <laughs> and I'll let you hear that in a second but um, for right now just just watch for a minute and just focus your eyes turn the lights down put the screen big if you're on your phone cast it to your TV and uh, the reason I'm showing you is that we don't fight against flesh and blood but principalities powers Spiritual wickedness in high places. There's a lot of a lot of things going on, and I think as we draw closer to the end, we're going to be revealed. Some of this stuff's going to be revealed to us. And I just, as crazy as the sound, I choose to show you. And I have all kinds of stuff going on in my house that's just not right, like a big old leak, about seven thousand dollar leak, and on and on and on. I don't want to talk about it too much, but anyways, there's a few things, and uh, you know. So I do get attacked and uh, keep me in prayer. But I'm still gonna show Abaddon or whatever this creature is and Molak and everything else. So keep watching.
taking this little clip here to show you Jabba the Hutt. He was a dirty, nasty gangster. We thought he was just in the movie, huh? These are all demons from the other side. Man, this is not just a situation. So you remember now, huh? What is that, guys? That is something to look at right there. If you see something like that, let's look at this one. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to push this up, so it might take a second. Um, I'm going to keep pushing it up so you can really see what's out here. See, and if this stuff is right by the, the moon. Incredible weird moon. Now you see the mountain right here? This is a strange picture, man. This thing. You catch a picture in the second heavens, that's my question. I mean, there's like whole villages here. I've never seen nothing like a cloud. See that? Look at that, guys. Can you believe that? You know, and I know you guys are going to be saying, well, it's a craft around the moon. You know, think about some of the stuff you say, and then all of a sudden you see something like this, and you're going, what the heck? You know, I got the music for this right here. This is a war going on. I got I got some Viking music I'm going to put on this thing. But just comment, have you ever seen anything like this? I mean, you guys see some strange moons. This is not pixelation. This is some strange weirdness from another dimension when they said that you know the bible says there will be signs in the moon signs in the stars see how that thing sits back it's like he went through a portal now, i don't can't believe i'm saying that but it's like it's in a portal the more you uh also when you're filtering with this really quality filter they made Pixio you guys know the name of it now I'm going to do something um, right now we're at 7k that's 8k right there guys final uh, 57 by 8k so you can see this looks like a mountain right it's almost like a like a valley going in Okay, so let's see if I could take some adjustments and I could change actually like the contrast make it more interesting for you. So I put my uh, my channel into the entertainment I can get more people to see some I've never seen anything this 3D looking. David, what planet do you live on? Where are you from? I'm just joking. You're saying there's something behind it? That right there is a ship. You can see it. Can't get any clearer than that, guys. Well, actually, I can get clearer than that. That's 8K. You're only going to probably see it at um, maybe 5K. But the quality would be superb. Look at that. These are my favorite kind of videos to do because it's like get to seek for stuff I've never seen before. And it's absolutely there's nothing I'm doing to make that 3D look like a tunnel. It's almost like a portal. Let's say that it's a portal and everybody talks about it. Let's say I just took your picture, David, and showed you a portal into the heaven, the heavenly realms. On September 17th, 
yesterday I something looked like a popping fresh doughboy with the evil eyes <laughs> and he had like a little a little cloud he was eating and I'm, I'm like and everybody's catching these pictures like this this is a couple you know a couple of years ago This thing, and I get really close. Now watch as I come in on it. It's like a little bridge there and a bridge right there. Do you see this? Oh, I'm just making that up, right? Yeah. Let's see, right there you can see it really good. It's like a road. And you, you look at stuff like this. You will be committed soon. But it was a good capture, David. Don't be afraid. Some, a lot of machines in this. Hey, Dominic, check out these machines. What is this? Someone get a 411 on that. I can't go any higher. Let me see. I can. Oops. Okay, I'm going to take it all the way up to 10K. Wow, I can't believe it's even letting me do it. See how long it takes to pixelate? There's so much color. It's 3D looking. slow because this poor computer not made to do this high, high dollar stuff it's not a Mac you know I use a, a regular old PC and that Apple stuff yeah you can see that I don't know I don't want to get weird guys but you know I'm gonna show you this another way okay now I'm gonna take any noise a way that's easy to take away so what's noise noise could be all this stuff we're looking at but if it's not then it's real stuff up there it kind of smooth it out some but in that you lose a bit, little bit of detail it looks like uh, how do I say that it's almost like a Buddha with a, a moon in his lap but actually more like a volcano or a place right here they sacrifice on this stone to this god. Now let's put a twist on it. And there's the sacrifice, whatever that is. Maybe. No. Now. I'm going to be slow. Every time I make a move it wants to reprocess it. But anyways okay I'll be back not that you'll know or nothing but I'll be back this is an incredible picture honey and you can see so much it's like another dimension coming into our dimension look at this look at this thing it's a moon and he goes what's behind the moon dog hey this guy goes, it's a moon, but what's behind it? And you could, it's almost like a giant. I've been seeing people putting up pictures of these big puffy faces with eyes and noses. But when you pull up close, you see all kinds of like spaceships and people and faces. Jabba the Hutt. He was a dirty, nasty gangster. Right? We thought he was just in the movie, huh? These are all demons from the other side. It's an illusion.
folks, this is none other than CERN opening up a portal, I believe. And the key is in his hand. Listen up. This is serious, real stuff. Revelation 9 And the fifth angel sounded, and I saw a star fall from heaven unto the earth, and to him was given the key of the bottomless pit. And he opened the bottomless pit, and there arose a smoke out of the pit, as the smoke of a great furnace. And the sun and the air were darkened by reason of the smoke of the pit. And there came out of the smoke locusts upon the earth, and unto them was given power, as the scorpions of the earth have power. And it was commanded them that they should not hurt the grass of the earth, neither any green thing, neither any tree, but only those men which have not the seal of God in their foreheads. And to them it was given that they should not kill them, but that they should be tormented five months. And their torment was as the torment of a scorpion when he striketh a man. And in those days shall men seek death and shall not find it, and shall desire to die, and death shall flee from them. And the shapes of the locusts were like unto horses, prepared unto battle. And on their heads were, as it were, crowns like gold, and their faces were as the faces of men. And they had hair as the hair of women, and their teeth were as the teeth of lions. And they had breastplates, as it were breastplates of iron. And the sound of their wings was as the sound of chariots of many horses running to battle. And they had tails like unto scorpions, and there were stings in their tails, and their power was to hurt men five months. And they had a king over them, which is the angel of the bottomless pit, whose name in the Hebrew tongue is Abaddon, but in the Greek tongue hath his name Apollyon. One woe is past, and behold, there come two woes more hereafter. And the sixth angel sounded, and I heard a voice from the four horns of the golden altar, which is before God, saying to the sixth angel which had the trumpet, And the four angels were loosed, 